Hi everyone, welcome back to another video from Kerala. We had a family gathering with everyone from our in-laws at our residence. I was not in a position to vlog it or rather I say it was not an organized one to vlog properly. Hence nothing to show on those days. Moreover, we all were having a relaxed time chit-chatting and having lots to share after a year. So I was completely off camera just that I shared a few pics on my Instagram story. and i hope you must have seen it if you're following me there i will show you our gathering next time we all are together and yes that will be there hopefully soon if you're following me for some time you will know that i work out with atp now that i'm on vacation i still need to be active and have chosen the time for a morning workout once it's done i'm satisfied because i don't know how the day will be we might go out or will be at some other's place so the best time i can work out is the early morning live session and after a workout it's our favorite kerala breakfast though there was a famous black chana curry to have it along with the kerala puttu i was craving for the banana combination today Everyone from my in-laws left after the gathering and Arman wanted to go with them. Rehan wanted him to be dropped at my parents' house. On this day I had to go for a dental checkup at the clinic where my brother and now my sister-in-law works. My brother left early as he had few early appointments. So me and Chinu, that's my sister-in-law, we both took a bus and went straight to the clinic. It's been some time since I traveled on a public bus and I love traveling on a bus. Though they drive rough, I enjoy it sometimes. Yeah. Look who I found for a company with. This little one is my brother's colleague's daughter and I had a good time spending with her from getting bored. I do a dental checkup with my brother every time I come for vacation and this time had a root canal to be done. Chinu learns a lot from my brother and that has helped in her career as well. My husband came to pick me up and we both had lunch together at a restaurant that my brother recommended.
we had to pick up arman so on the way we bought some snacks to have from my in-laws made tea and had it with everyone It wasn't raining for a few days after we came here so I was expecting no rain this monsoon. Even if there's no rain, being at home is very relaxing for me. Be it looking out from the window, sitting on the balcony or even sitting on the steps outside at the entrance. Just look at the sky and the stress flows away with the moving clouds and the sound of the chirping birds. Do comment below on what makes your mind relax. We all go through a lot of stress but there should be something that can keep you calm even if the stress exists on one side you relax on the other side for me it's the sound of rain the sound of fire the sound of the chirping birds especially in the morning or even the moving clouds in the sky It was continuously raining one day so on this rainy day we went to our ice cream shop ice mug but it's not just ice creams you get there there are hot specialties that you can enjoy having this monsoon kids have been insisting right from oman to go to ice mug so we went to try some new items that were recently added to the menu hot burgers that's mexican beef burger and grilled chicken burger these were really tasty Our favorite are the mini burgers that come in a set of 5. If you don't want 5, you get 3 in a set and that's something one person can have without overfilling their tummy. There are tea and coffee varieties added and what we had was both tea and coffee of saffron and lychee flavors. I'm having frappe for the first time which had a very different and unique taste. There's more on the menu but we wanted to try a few of our joys. That's lychee iced tea. Very refreshing. And there comes our all-time favorite waffle and the Nutella with ice cream is divine. Kids enjoyed this death by chocolate even the last time so they wanted it again. We didn't order one for each. It was just one item for all and we all shared it. This is nata di coco salad and it's something very different from the normal fruit salad you have from an ice cream parlor. This is a mixed version. Very refreshing and very tasty.
My elder sister-in-law Nasri was already here for vacation a week before we landed and she was at her parents home to spend some days with them. She came home this day evening so we went there to meet them. I cooked a flavorful rice for dinner and it tasted almost like biryani rice without any meat or extra flavorings like chicken stock. If you are a vegetarian you should definitely try this. I'm preparing it with 4 cups of rice. Use a pressure cooker. To this heat 2 or 3 tablespoons of ghee and 2 or 3 tablespoons of oil. Here I used coconut oil but you can use any oil of your choice. Then add 3 medium onions sliced. Saute it till it's almost fried. The onion should be light brown shade and only then you will get that good flavor of the rice. Sorry for the lighting it is quite dark here. At this moment I added a ground paste of ginger garlic and green chilies. Saute till the raw smell goes. add two medium tomatoes and let it go soft add some salt and mix add some coriander leaves now if you want you can add a few mint leaves now add 2 tablespoon coriander powder 1/2 teaspoon turmeric powder 1/2 teaspoon garam masala powder and mix for 2 minutes on medium flame Now wash and drain the rice. Here I have used jeera gashala rice. Mix this in the masala for three or four minutes. Then add hot water. As this is in the pressure cooker, I double the amount of water to the rice, reducing one cup. So I added seven cups of hot water to four cups of rice. Check salt and add if needed. Cover the cooker and lock the pressure. Cook for two whistles on high flame. and then turn off the flame once the pressure is all released open the lid and that's the flavorful biryani rice was happy because everyone enjoyed having this rice more than the kerala parotta we ordered from the restaurant After some kitchen work, I spent some time with my brother playing games and I'm proud to be shameless to play this. I don't think you need to. These games are real stress busters for me. And looking at my nieces enjoying their time, it's another relaxing moment seeing them stress free. It was Nisri's birthday the next day, so we cut a cake at sharp twelve a.m. Hope you all enjoyed watching today's video with glimpses here and there. See you soon with another one. Until then, take care. Bye bye.